How's it going guys? Welcome back to Battle Chef Brigade. I think I'm just looking for someone new to challenge. I think that's kind of the next step here. I can challenge Kieran or Vladimir. I honestly can't remember what his name was. I can challenge this guy too, Caesar. I don't think I want to challenge him right now. He kind of wigs me out a little bit. He seems pretty tough. I'll I'll take on this dopey looking goth wannabe vampire or whatever. Would you like to have a duel with me? Of course, but be warned. I'm rumored to be this year's front runner in the competition. Yeah, according to you. <laughs> I mean, like, that's I'm not really going to take your word for it. Oh, actually, maybe I should ask someone else then. <laughs> it's definitely the tournament committee stirring up some theater. I find it rather embarrassing, to be honest. Nonetheless, I accept your challenge. Uh, I guess I don't really have any different loadout to use. I think I'm happy enough with the stuff that I have have right now. Take it to the kitchen, yo. Settle this shit on the grill. Or on the stove. Or in a, a, a pot. Or uncooked, if that's what it calls for. I'll just... I'll, I'm just going to be winging it, honestly, so we'll see. I hope he doesn't have any hard and fast strategies or anything like that, because winging it is how I got here, and winging it's how I plan on seeing it through. Did he change? this morning reminded of a quote from the legendary chef Robichon. An ingredient is only as extraordinary as the chef who wields it. I could have sworn this guy was wearing different colors. I think he might have changed. When I look at our contestants, I see the precision of their blades and the richness of 10,000 flavors boiling in their hearts. This guy and Belchior, who they have some sort of idea in their mind that there's very limited amount of flavors in the world. And I, I think they, they might just have a very limited perspective of things, but it's also a crazy fantasy world, and I can't really pretend to understand. Extraordinary, he doesn't even begin to cut it. I cannot wait to see the wonders they have in store for our judge today. Extraordinary? Well, thanks, Kamen. I don't know if I've earned that much praise. Am I still the Iron the Stomach? Of her first victory, the Iron Stomach is ready to claim another win. Well, presumably the other guy won his first battle too, Mina. right? Or he's going with hungry because his stomach, it's like a whole, it's a gag thing he's going with here. Our next contestant is a man who's as altruistic as he is intelligent. Leonid, the gift bringer! Ooh, I hope he brought me a gift. I wouldn't All mind a quick aside, gift. I'm excited to test your skill. This competition is much friendlier than I would have expected. They made it seem like such a big deal, and everyone is so chill to each other. There's like no trash talk whatsoever, <laughs> except for literally from trash. Mistress of the prestigious Oris Academia. Please welcome Instructor Meridane. God, she looks like a crabby old bag. My real assumption is that the final battle of this game is going to be me versus Trash, right? Like, he's going to go to the finals with me and we'll have to fight each other. And it's like, oh, but they're such good friends. And that's my prediction, no at least. To flatter me so. We'll soon discover just how competent these chefs truly are. I don't think we've had a hint dropped of what flavors she likes. Does it really matter, though? I have every... Is oh, there we go. Nature. I was going to say I have every pot type. Flavor becomes as adaptive as the energy itself. It is in your best interest to impress me with it. All right, I'll get as much water in there as I can. For today's theme ingredient, we look to a beast that has a heart of fire. Yeah, but we want water. Wait, am I supposed to go fight the dragon? Because that was a pain in the ass. <laughs> it's pretty exhausting. I mean, how many dragons are there in this world that you can just go casually kill up a dragon for the sake of, like, a, a quick steak for one of these dinners? I also noticed at the judges' table, there's three chairs there and three different things to light up with, like, a judge's preference. And I wonder if it was... If at some point there'll be multiple judges and it'll be like, I like water, I like water, I like fire. And so it's like... Water has to be your primary, fire has to be your secondary. Every hunter knows the fearsome... I, he's building it up now, so I feel like it's not going to be Dragon. He's going to undersell it. It's going to be the, the squeaker or whatever the octopus thing is called. Dragon! Oh, god damn, it is a dragon! <laughs> Shit, son. That's such a cool dragon design, though. I first time I fought it, I didn't really have time to appreciate it, but it's pretty hardcore. I kind of love it. It's like furry. It's very different from like a typical dragon. It doesn't really, it doesn't look like it can fly. Those look like wings, but I don't think you can fly with them. I kind of love it. It's a really awesome design. 
Viva the brig brigade! <laughs> Viva the brigade! All right, uh, water it is. I I guess I guess I'm just gonna run straight for the dragon since I know he's a bit of a bitch to fight. He he he'll take a take a little bit of effort I'd say, and then I'll come back. And on my way back, I'll try and gather up a lot of water and stuff. I also wanted to get this bean. Ah, I'm not gonna bother because it's uh, all plant-based things. I guess, I guess, oh no, I botched that. I didn't mean to chuck a whirlwind the wrong direction there. Fucker, why? Why was I able to do this in training but can't just get in my ass handed to me now? Throw daggers and things. Come on, Mina Han. Don't let a, don't let a stupid puny little dragon get one over on ya. He's just a stupid dragon. Oh, god damn it. I'm gonna fucking die. Uh, do I just keep my distance? Oh, I did die! I actually straight up died. Oh shit, you just spawned back. Oh, that wasted so much time. I thought maybe I had just lost the battle already. Uh, well, I I better make sure I make it back to him quickly there, and hope they didn't heal. Oh good, I don't think he healed. Good, good, good. Alright, that's a very, a very, very poor start. Not, not cool with that. These guys, I think, are... Uh, they have quite a bit of water, but they're not as fully water-based as I thought they might have been. The tomato is there a bad bet? Ooh, ooh, the cheap, cheap, stupid bird, whatever they're called. I think they have lots of water ingredients. Uh, freak, I got bone on that one. Not, not what I was looking for. Uh, not what I'm looking for. This is bad. This, I've used half my time so far. There, there, there. I don't really want to... Maybe, maybe, whatever. Now, now that I've killed this thing most of the way, I might as well take it out fully and and claim some ingredients here. Uh, just a bunch of fire and stuff. Not worth it. Oh god, I gotta run back to the pantry, anyways. I should run back and see if I can get some sauces or something quickly here. This is not gonna be. I, I'm not. I'm, I don't think I can pull off a very good dish here right now. Shit. I I I need to be faster, so I just need to start grabbing ingredients. I think and make do with what what I got please be water water sauce oh good 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 watery sauce it sounds terrible it doesn't sound very appetizing but hopefully I can do something with this all right just start chucking water based things in here watery sauce. oh that was the sauce I didn't mean to chuck the water sauce in there well that was it that was a hell of a waste I didn't mean to have that in there I have more water based things than I maybe thought that I did though uh, let's, let's get this stuff cooking and, and make do with what we have here. Once we get some of those flavors com combinized, <laughs> then, then I can worry about chucking in some other things here like the nectar. Uh, I can't quite get the dragon heart in there yet. Must stir, make room for dragon hearts so that I don't get ragged on for not using the proper ingredients. Oh, 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 I can, I can free up room for one more... See, I wonder if because I didn't put the dragon in first, if that's going to hurt me. You know? Because now, now all of a sudden, dragon... Oh, I have way too many... Alright, that's enough of that. I gotta, you, gotta, you gotta get out of there, because I can't have anything other than water become the main ingredient there. What, what else can I... What else can I add? Shit. I don't, I don't know if because dragon wasn't the first thing I added, you know? Uh, if maybe the, the dish will be considered something else. Piranha Nectar, that's exactly what I wanted. Uh, maybe this egg, maybe I ought to take this egg with me. The egg is good. The egg is good. You're, you're going, you're going immediately in there. Uh, pantry. Egg, egg, egg. There's not enough time. I, I'm, I'm panicking, I'm here, I'm so flustered. Not enough time, not enough time. Uh, pantry. Egg. Egg, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Stir. Ah, uh, uh, how much time do I have here? 13 seconds? Holy sweet fuck. Combine! Oh wait, no, 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 that's as, that's as combined as it can get. Alright, just serve it, serve it, serve it, it doesn't matter. It's probably not the best. 132, I ended up a bit better than I thought I was gonna be. Thank but, you for your hard work, god damn. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. I got confused of which was a level 2 and which was a level 1 looking water thing, so I was all, I was all thrown off by that all of a sudden. I think I gave him primarily water, her. And I hope it's dragon heavy. I used a lot of dragon ingredients, but it certainly wasn't the first ingredient I used. Maybe just having it in there at all is good. 
Yeah, he had to smoke armor rock heart. I don't really know what an armor rock is and take a barrier and eggs melange like is any of that dragon? I don't know. Did you listen to what I said at the beginning of the match? This dish needed to exude watery flavor. I wish I would use the watery sauce better. I, I don't know. I screwed that up big time. Water must have the most superlative gems in the dish. And he has a lot of fire. I think he has equal parts. Fire, earth, and water there. They're, they're two each. So he'll... Oh, 164. God, he had a strong dish. I guess I could have too, but I was purposely trying to avoid mixing gems that were only going to hurt me. He's not going to get knocked on harder? Damn it. Karana nectar shaved ice garnished with watery sauce and squickle tentacle. Damn it. Yeah, so the dragon didn't go in there soon enough, but the fact that it has dragon in there must be good, right? You've captured the essence of the watery flavors without your dish becoming overly complex. I, yeah, I don't think I had a single other level 3 thing in there. I specifically avoided it. So I got a shitload of water in there that I think she liked. A lovely example of culinary prowess. I don't remember what he had, but I think it was very close to that. This is going to be a little bit down to the, the wire iron here. Stomach clenches another hard fought victory. Mina ha, I think I only won by like 10 or 20 or something though, right? Oh, a little bit better than I thought. But still, that was... Things are getting dicey here. Luckily, that guy, what was his title? He's like the gift giver or something, so probably he'll give me some sort of gift afterwards. I'm honored we had this match, Miss Han. You will make a great battle chef someday. Please, take this as a sign of my faith in you. Nice, thank you. I do want the gift. But before I forget about it, whatever the next dish is, whatever the secret ingredient is, if it's dragon or whatever again, I need to try and add dragon to the dish first to see if that makes it specifically a dragon dish and then to see if that makes the judges like like the dish more if it's another way to gain bonus points other than having the right gems I can't handle all this formality <laughs> thanks for being so nice Leonid. I'm sure you're going to get in the brigade too not when you keep losing is rainbow droplet the captured essence of pure rainbow three rainbow ingredients that, that'll just go straight into my pantry, presumably, or... Because, I mean... I mean, rather than having to collect bones and mix them together, you'll just have that in the pantry to use? Yeah, that's all that that is, so... It's just a way to get... That, that is very useful. I definitely, like, I'm not turning my nose up at that or anything. Uh, maybe... Maybe I ought to buy one more useful thing here. Uh, I think I'd rather save up for attacks and stuff. It's, I'm, I'm being so cautious I don't want to use the pantry too often or anything, or use the bot pantry items too often. And so I, I think I'm just going to save up for cool new moves and stuff. Alright, I guess it's time for the bed. Bed time it is. Let me just sneak my way into the, my bedroom here and I'll just, I'll just hide in this corner. Ready for battle if anyone comes looking for me with my daggers drawn. But really though, I think I am just gonna go to bed, and then next time I'll uh, I'll I'll do more battles. <laughs> it seems to be the progression here. Right now, but I'll just take a quick nap first. Sleepy Mina, always sleeping away the most important parts of the day. Crazy, it's only been a couple days, really. Well, next time, I'll go downstairs, see how late I am for another day, and see what new challenges await. I'll have the different jobs to do, earn some money and stuff, but mostly, I, mostly I'm feeling eager about getting into actual battles and stuff, you know? So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you again soon.